right now. We begin with new information in a case of road rage that took a deadly turn. The man accused of murder claiming it was self-defense. Thanks for joining us first at four. I'm Nicole Versansky. And I'm Brian Duffy. Will a jury buy all of this? That's the question. Katie Tursik was inside the courtroom for day two of testimony. We want to warn you that some of what you may hear here will be graphic. Would this uh, type of injury be immediately debilitating to someone? Uh, his blood pressure is going to drop pretty quickly. Um, this could be something that would be fatal within uh, seconds to minutes. A gunshot wound to the back. That's what Summit County Medical Examiner Dr. Robert Schott says killed George Jensen. The 40-year-old shot last May and what police say was a case of road rage. Dr. Schott taking the stand in the trial of DeCary Kennard. He's charged with murder. I think like a two-liter bottle not quite three quarters full. That's how much blood was lost internally as a result of this gunshot wound. Video showed the incident that happened on I-76 in Norton. Police say Kennard fired the fatal shot at Jensen. Kennard's defense attorney says he was simply defending himself. I don't know whether a case involves self-defense or not. Uh, that is correct. You're just going to list it as a homicide because it was at the hands of another. Correct. And the cause of death was gunshot wounds in this case? Yes, it was. The manner of death was listed as homicide. Yes. Since this trial started on Friday, Jensen's family has been inside of the courtroom. Today, they got emotional as autopsy photos were shown. I asked the family if they wanted to talk, but they told me they will not be doing so until the trial is over. In Akron, Kay Tersek, 19 News.